You know, for me, one of the biggest reasons I don't call myself an alcoholic is because it takes away from my personal responsibility for this. You know, when I look back at my own life as a drinker, I have to take 100% responsibility for everything that I've done before, because if I don't, then how am I going to take 100% responsibility for things that are going to happen from now on, right? If I give myself this out, this excuse, you know, that it wasn't me, it was, it was something that was inside of me that was broken, which meant that I couldn't drink, that I couldn't drink like so-called normal people. Um, then how am I going to move my life forwards in an honest way? And this is, I'm saying this again, this is from a personal perspective. It just doesn't sit well with me. You know, um, every drop of alcohol that ever passed my lips was got there because I put it there, right? Every time I went into the off license to buy the liquor store, to buy beer or wine or spirits, it was down to me. Every time I went into the pub and stayed in the pub and handed my money across the counter, it was down to me. Every time I lifted up that pint and put it into my mouth, it was down to me. I have to take that responsibility for myself and that precludes me calling myself an alcoholic because like I said, that's, a, that's an excuse. Now, like I said, if you wanna call yourself an alcoholic, that is completely up to you but there are consequences to everything that you do in life you know uh, all these labels they don't come without expense you know they you cannot have 100 percent responsibility and then say well i wasn't responsible for that it doesn't work you know so what that did for me was from day one as soon as i stopped drinking it was right this is something that I don't want to do anymore, not something that I couldn't do anymore, right? And that sets you off on a different path, sets you off on a different tra trajectory in your life because you're coming from, um, I'm coming from a place of complete honesty, as far as I can be honest, you know? And there's, a, there's different levels to that, of course, you know, which I've found out over the years. Um, you know, we're, if you want somebody that will delude you into something, right? I'm the wrong person for a start. But if you really want the person who is gonna manipulate you the most, it's yourself. If you allow yourself to down those roads. Now we're all manipulators. We're all gonna manipulate ourselves to a certain degree, but it's how much, um, how much you know the truth, but you still allow something else to come in. Now, like I said, this is from a complete personal perspective. So it is what it is. You know, I feel like I'm much more in control of my life now, much more in control of my decisions by saying to myself, you were always in control of the alcohol. You were always in control of everything that you put into your body, right? For what it's worth. Take care, onwards and upwards.